Right now, more than 65,000 people are packing downtown Indy for the National FFA Convention. It's just another sign that the convention industry here in Indianapolis has recovered from the years during the pandemic. But what about downtown Indy as a whole? It's a big question for so many business owners and for patrons. Fox 59's Eric Graves live now from the convention center digging into some of those questions. Hey, if you're Shell and Dan, yeah, it is a packed convention center. Really, it has been packed all day. This is kind of the, uh, the ghost town we've really seen with those blue corduroy jackets now back here in central Indiana from states all over the place. We even saw Hawaii around today. So really people from all over the country here today in Indianapolis and they're expecting a record crowd for the weekend, potentially a record crowd. It could be upwards of 70,000 people, which would be a record for the FFA. This is some video we've been taking throughout the day as people have really traversed downtown as a whole, like you guys talked about when you were tossing to me. This is something that businesses and the city looks forward to all year and really that record crowd is what Indianapolis has been seeing with these conventions this year a return to pandemic numbers even exceeding those pre pandemic numbers but this is just one phase of the overall downtown recovery a study by the University of Toronto tracking cell phone data in downtown areas shows Indianapolis is at 79 percent of what it was in 2019 before the pandemic that's 79 percent of unique visitors to the downtown geographical area the University of Toronto is studying. Now this ranks Indy 28th in North America and fourth in the Midwest. But Chris Gall with Visit Indy says they keep a close eye on studies like these and their numbers suggest an even better recovery. When you look at our hotel occupancy, we're only about six percentage points off what occupancy was in our downtown hotel years, hotel partners pre-pandemic, which was a record-setting 2019. 